in adult patients who have adult onset atopic dermatitis, my experience is that the rate of atopic comorbidities is actually pretty similar to the background population. So we, we, and that makes sense because we now know that the reason for atopic comorbidities was having atopic dermatitis as a child. So when you had it as a child, uh, arrow allergens, food allergens, those kinds of things got transcutaneous uh, penetration and thereby exposure to the cutaneous immune system as opposed to the mucosal immune system, uh, which is where the exposure is in people who don't have atopic dermatitis. But so if you didn't get it as, a, if you didn't have atopic dermatitis as a child, your immune system learned to be tolerant of those food antigens and those arrow allergens, just like everybody else's did. Then by the time you get it as an adult, your immune system is already uh, tolerant of those antigens. So you, you generally don't develop atopic comorbidities if you have adult onset atopic dermatitis.